other rooms. This is actually, it's got a pretty cool vibe to it. So, um, you guys ready for a great session? Yeah. Yes. What's the word of the day? Let's come up with the word of the day. Anybody can come up with the word of the day. Somebody throw out a word. Okay. How about, okay, how about uh, obliterate? <coughs> obliterate. What we're going to do today is we're going to obliterate the confusion that comes with public speaking. So we're going to demystify it and make it very, very simple. What's the word? Obliterate. obliterate. Okay, very good. So how many people here are very committed to becoming better speakers, better communicators, literally by the time we finish our session here today? Let me see you guys. Okay, oh, okay, somewhat. And how many people understand that communication works for those that work hard at it? Let me hear you say aye. Aye. Okay, very good. Now, I can promise you guys that you will become better speakers, better presenters if we do one thing together, if we fully participate. So put your hand on your heart. I promise. I promise. To participate. To participate. Okay, put your hand on your other heart. Everything is energy. Everything is what? Energy. Okay, very good. Very good. How many hearts do you have? One. How many minds do you have? One. Okay, we're testing you. So I believe that we have a mastermind. You guys know what a mastermind is? Yes. What is a mastermind? Somebody help me out. A lot of people thinking together. A lot of people thinking together. So I don't think we just have one mind. I think right now there's about 30 minds here. So that, does that mean that we can ever get stuck on any one issue or problem? No, no absolutely not. We're going to obliterate the confusion. We're going to demystify. We're going to make it very simple. And everyone is going to be able to create a presentation literally in the next, how many, 45 minutes, I think? 45 minutes. So turn to your neighbor, give him a high five, say, I'm ready. Are you? I'm ready. Are you? Are you? <laughs> okay, very good. <laughs> Get a high five. That's okay. Here's what we're gonna do. So <laughs> everything is energy. Everything is energy, right? This is for my other heart. Everything is energy, right? So what we want to do is we want to get into the energy, and it's okay if we help each other out here as long as we're learning, because it's been proven that if we can link emotion and energy to information, we retain up to 70% more of that information. So we're here, we're fast students, we're very, very smart, and we're always looking for the hack, for the shortcut, so that we can uh, have a, a, a cutting edge advantage over the competition. Yes or yes? Yes. yes. Okay, very good. So what we're gonna do, is we're gonna learn right now the three T process. How many T's? Three. three. Three T process to creating a presentation. Now the first one is the title, okay? Has everyone at least thought about your topic? Yeah. yeah. What are you gonna talk about? Very good, okay. So what we're gonna do is we're literally gonna go ahead and, I think this, this will work, yes it will work. Go ahead and create a title box and use a magic marker or a non-magical marker. Send that marker. Yes. Pass them around. Mr. Sketch. Mr. Sketch. Mr. Sketch. We're going to write your topic, but we're going to write the title. There you go. I want the Excellent. Very good, very good. I got my All we're going to do is draw a box. Let's see, let's see if we can show example. Very accomplished student here in the front row. <laughs> that's exactly what we're looking for. Don't devalue yourself. We're fast students here. Okay. But don't make it too, too big because there's going to be two other T's that will fill up the poster board. See that? So, so far, so Perfect. good. Very good. Now, yours is on. Okay. All right. Now, I'm going to give you guys a couple of different tricks for creating titles. So, the first one is called From Pain to Game. Game. Very good. So, think about one word that identifies the pain that your audience is feeling. And then think about one word that identifies the gain that your presentation is going to provide. 
So, example, I teach public speaking. It would be from stage fright to spotlight. Yeah. Uh -huh. Pain to gain. Okay, that's one hack for the title. Okay. Another hack for the title is the how to solution. How to solution. So you say how to, and then you fill in the solution that your talk is going to provide. Example, I teach public speaking, so I would say how to monetize your speaking. What? That would work for me, for my topic, right? How to fill in the solution, right in the topic, for the title. And then the third hack for the title is called the, everybody go like this, the mystique. What's it called? Mystique. Mystique. Put a little mystery in your title. So, example, my five-step system to packaging your passion in the next 90 days. That would work for me because I teach public speaking. My three-step process for whatever it is, your topic, right? My seven-step formula Think about the process, system, formula. So we've given you guys from pain to gain, how to solution, and then what's the last one? Mystique. The mystique. Now, do you have to use any one of those? No. No, we're, we're very creative thinkers. We think outside the box. You don't have to use that. We can think about our favorite books, the title. Movies, title. TV show, title. There's a lot of ways to do titles. But what I want you to do right now is to fill in to your box. Create a title for your presentation. Okay, I'm gonna do the same thing with you, so I'm literally gonna...